funky. Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, my name is Juliet. Karibu, karibu sana. I hope you will consider subscribing down below. And yeah, if you're a returning subscriber, thank you. So, it's another vlog with your girl. I recently moved and I had promised you guys a tour before I moved, but things went really fast and I I already moved. Yeah, so I'm just going to give you a tour of how I set up. And you might notice that some things are out of order. Kindly bear with me. I'm still organizing my space, trying to find where things fit. And yeah, you will notice that kuna vitu zenye ziko too out of place. Yeah, I'm going to give you a tour. From, from now on, you're just going to be seeing my surroundings. Consider subscribing if, you're not, if you have not yet subscribed. So yeah, buckle up and let's get into it. <laughs> So the first thing you see is the door. This is the door mat. Let me show you the whole door and how it looks like. Tell me, tell me you don't like this. Tell me, tell me. So these are the curtains that I bought. You can see how gorgeous they look, right? Let me show you the texture. Look at that, gorgeous. So the first thing I fell in love Nyumba with is this door. Any lighting, lighting in this house is superb and it's glass from Ju Adi Chin. So that is the door. And then right beside the door, you have this mirror that I got. You remember me doing a video on bringing the mirror to this place? Yeah, so this is the mirror. It's not as tall as I would have wanted it, but it's bigger compared to the one I had before. Now right below it, we have this stool. So I spray painted it black, and this is how it turned out. Kuna parts that are peeling, but I'm planning on sorting that out. And then we have this thing here. I thrifted both of this. This was 100 shillings, and the fairy lights were also 100 shillings. We also have these tiny cards. They're just the normal cards, but smaller in size. Let me show you. I also thrifted this, by the way. These are going for 50 shillings. See? It's just the normal card, but smaller in size. I just thought they were cute. So I decided to put them here. This I also thrifted. This is the diffuser. I thrifted this glass. It has this thing here that I thought was cute. So I got it. And yeah, that is here. So that is from the door. And you come to this other side. You have this puff. You remember it? So this puff now has a space. And it fits perfectly there. Yeah, then oh, go back to this side. Tani same, you make a bit So you have this sisal chair. I actually feel, feel like it doesn't fit whatever I'm trying to do with this house. So I'm either going to sell it at a very cheap price or give it to someone. I don't know yet. If I find someone who wants to buy it, I can sell it. If not, I'll just uh, give it to someone who I feel needs it. Then we have this side here. 
we have my bed look at that i was actually worried because my bed doesn't have a headboard so i was worried itakaje like with the window then this is how it turned out look at that i think it's gorgeous so we have that window then we have my bed right below it fits perfectly i was worried about sleeping with my head near the window but uh, it's been okay so right beside the bed we have this part here i gave out my mirror that i was using to put these things because i didn't know where to put it honestly plus now i have a bathroom that has a mirror which is okay so this is where i put my body and skincare essentials and also fragrances then right next to it we have the entertainment section yeah it fit perfectly i was worried that i wouldn't find a, way, a place to put it but yeah there it is then next below it we have this white rug yes i wanted to use this for my front door but uh, my friend advised me not to here it's not easy for it to get dirty yeah and then right above it we have the closet my tiny closet the bags up there it's just the same as it was in the previous house yes and then when you go to the opposite side now you have my shoe rack i'm still uh going to paint it i just haven't gotten the time to do it yes that's my shoe rack <laughs> yeah kuna some shoes that are missing because i've washed them and then right below we have the laundry basket so let me just finish with the bathroom then take you to the kitchen so right after this rug you have this door here which leads you to the bathroom let me just switch on the lights yeah so this is the bathroom and i haven't installed the hot shower yet that is why it looks that way so here we have the shower caddy i got this from home of lux by riziki if you're interested kindly check her out on instagram this was going for a thousand shillings and then we have uh, my bathing gloves then this window where i just put my toilet cleaners light in a misbehave toilet cleaners and then uh, right below we have the toilet and then up we have this part where i put my laundry and hair hair care <laughs> and tissues and then over here this is behind the door we have this mirror and this sink here yes <laughs> so this is basically the bathroom to her it's not so big but if you if you see the difference you no, no. this one is bigger than the one I had before so yeah let's go to the kitchen quick 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 okay so from the bathroom there's this part here this is where the shoe rack is you can see how it needs painting for real for real so we have this part here my mom is around yeah that's her bargaining baby and her food so i haven't been able to mount these pictures <laughs> i'm st i still don't know still don't know if i want to put them back or what to do with them but i'll decide so next to those pictures we have this door here that leads you to the kitchen when you get into the kitchen is when you 
you need a dustbin. <laughs> so we have this part here. These are shelves. And on it you have my spices. Remember? And then also these I got from Home of Lux by Riziki. They are going for $6.50 each. They are very nice. I love them. They, are, they come in white and black so you can choose Gani Unataka. You have my spices. Then uh, also have more storage up there. I just put the extra household items. Then when you come to this side, you have this table. Remember it? Where I put my gas cylinder and this. So <laughs> I wanted to cook something, hence this. So we have this part. This is my drinking water. And then over here we have some food. It's my mom brought it and then right on this other side we have the sink so what I don't love about this house is that it doesn't have a counter like so you know how a counter looks like so in Akufanya also you avoid piling dishes here yeah so this is the sink then we have right here this part I use for extra storage and then right above we have this part where I put my cups, glasses and plates after washing them. And then right beside it we have this window here. Yes, like that, like that, like that. And yeah, <laughs> that's the whole house. Basically, so we have this flower here. Just put it there to make the place a little colored. It's so white. <laughs> and yeah, that's the whole house. Okay, so we've come to the end of this video. <laughs> I feel like this one is shorter compared to the one I before the previous house tour I don't know why I think Nimendaraka but Sinimawanyesha everything is there something that I haven't shown I don't think so so yeah that is everything I had for today I hope you like it I hope you love it as much as I do it has potential you know, this house has so much potential and I can't wait to decorate it to make it the most coziest place ever so if you have not yet subscribed please consider subscribing thank you so much for 600 subscribers would you tell your friend to tell a friend i'll see you soon in the next one bye guys